Uh, I couldn't find this plugin, so I made a script. Uh, so I made a tab objects, and that's where I have all the objects listed that I want to import that I use fre frequently. Uh, but it's just too time consuming to go into the folders and uh, find the object. So especially when you have a lot of objects. So I was like, okay, how can I do that? So I first time I ever made the script, uh, I used this uh, Lightbeam macro recorder and it basically just, uh, you just hit record and when you're done, you set the output file and I will save the file. Um, so that's basically what I did. So I got this, so I set it to this file, and that looks something like this. The thing though is that when I saved this one, it had backslash um, instead of forward slash. So for some reason, it wouldn't open the, the file. So I just changed that backslash to forward slash uh, in Notepad and saved it, and that fixed it. So it's probably a bug in the macro recorder or something like that. So anyway, that made it work. So you can see it's pretty straightforward. It's just load object and load that object. Um, so let's see if this works. Um, so of course I just add the plugin and uh, Choose a location for it under configure menus and a shortcut if you want to do that. So if I hit Alt I now, this hopefully it will import that model. So let's see from that uh, folder. Okay, so Alt I and there you go. Uh, one thing to notice though is that often you don't want to overwrite this one so you might want to set the properties to read only to be sure that you don't overwrite it then you'll save this in another place instead or use for example package scene 